Hey there. Today we will look into the magical gifts. What if I tell you that gifts can be a perfect match for effective data visualizations? For example, adding a dynamic company logo or a dynamic background for landing page or including a how to tip. So let's get started first with dynamic background for a landing page. Go to page settings and click on canvas background. First of all set the transparency to zero and then browse your GIF file. Usually I use Giphy.com and download the GIFs. You can create your own as well. And there you see a dynamic background for a landing page of your report. By using PowerPoint, I will show an example on how to create your own GIF in the last example of how to export tip button in this video. Now let's go and see our next example of adding a dynamic logo to a report. You can create your logos in canvas.com and use in your reports. Comment below if you need a tutorial on creating your logos. Create a blank button and go to style property and turn off the borders and icons option. Now turn on the fill option and select GIF file. Set to image fit option to fit and that's it. Congratulations you have a dynamic logo in your report. Now let's go and see our last example, which is very important for our report users. As they may find difficulty in exporting the data to a file. So let's start it. First create an information button. Instead you may also add an image as well. If we hover on this button a GIF should play and show me how to export data from a published report. Next create a card and add a measure, as card requires a measure to be added we need something here. I have already created a measure with just some blank spaces. Disable the category label and then in the general settings turn off the background. Place this card on top of the information button. Now we need to create a tooltip for this card, so that once we hover on this, it should start playing. For this we need to create a video recording in PowerPoint and export it to a GIF file. Open PowerPoint and just go to insert and click on screen recording. And then start recording the export data task. Once that is done, we need to export it to a GIF file. Now create a tooltip page, for this we need to go page format and then enable the allow users tooltip in page information. Then go to canvas background and add your GIF with transparency to zero. And also set image fit as fit. Now go back to the card and set the tooltip to report page and select the page which we had created just now. And there you go, on hovering the button we can see the export data video playing. That's it for today. Hope you like this video, if you have, please like and subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.